other things so sit back relax and enjoy one of my favorite heroes well bill how do you account for the the, 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 the episode on the planet could tell oh five two seven point eight six whenever you've had the opportunity to do comedy you've always dem demonstrated a flair for it do you regret not having done more of it that's a joke bill given that you played the lead on t t t tv show my show was a vision of the future whose time had come and here's how it works i'm going to ask you quest questions they're not difficult but being able to count to four helps ready good i think i'd like to understand your last question we think we know how we came to be here on our world we've studied this how did you come to be Oh, simple. I was created because there was a gap in the entertainment market for something I suppose you could call <laughs> swagger. Perfection. And they keep me on. Well, I guess I'm good at what I do, and I'd like to think they go for my particular brand of modesty. And then there's been this hitch over my birth certificate. When did life start on your world? Well, I was lucky to arrive at all, big fella. It took me to three TV repair shops before I got here. And let me say, it's a nice hat. Clothes are very important, I find. And I wouldn't dream of wearing anything off the peg. Bill, big fella, I think for holiday wear, and I'm a bit of an expert in this, a nice pair of long, baggy shorts would suit you down to the ground. We've worked uh, for millennia, or many, many orbits of the sun to reach this level. What are you doing here? How shall we say, right off the top of my head in quotation marks? I'm not just a DJ. I mean, some people say my swing is so perfect it does look computerized, but no. I know how you get along. You're Irish. I've heard that's the way to get on. You look like the kind of guy that probably uses garters with his knee sock. You're not doing badly, big fella. Good show, popular, successful. I mean, I don't like using the word rival. How do you get your audience going? Just like Star Trek. Everybody speaks English very well. Sometimes they have accents. Das Nutzer Ich war in einem deutschen Restaurant. Ja. And so on. I would be, um, I'd want to know where they came from. You mean humans with a single figure golf handicap? I want to thank you very much for coming on my show. I think this was the happiest day of my life. Ha! Well, well, well. Your last question. Uh, this is a tough one. This one's uh, a little bit delicate at the moment. How do you feel about that? Razzmatazz. And lots of other words with Zs in them. But it brings up an interesting question. You've talked about being a vegetarian and you've mentioned your love for animals. Picture this. You're stranded on a desert island. Your only companions. A horse, a whale, and a Doberman pincer. Which do you eat first? Well, um... Well, you can't. But I can. I want to talk to you about something even bigger, namely... D. 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 Evolution. Denial of evolution is unique to the United States. I mean, we are the world's most advanced technological... So, I mean, you could say Japan. But generally, the United States is where most of the innovation still happens. People still move to the United States. Uh, and that's largely because of the intellectual capital we have, the, the general understanding of science. No, 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 let's get our priorities right. When you have a portion of the population that doesn't believe in it, it holds everybody back, really.
Evolution is the fundamental idea in all of life science, in all of biology. It's like, it's very much analogous to trying to do geology without believing in tectonic plates. Well, these rock things are all very well if you like them, but you know, no ordinary people like you and, well, ordinary people like you oughtn't to be afraid to speak up. You're just not gonna get the right answer. Your whole world is just gonna be a mystery instead of an exciting place. I also enjoy a good laugh. <laughs> As my old professor Carl Sagan said, when you're in love, you want to tell the world. So. Well, you know, I don't have much time these days for the big G. I'm so much in demand. Once in a while I get people that really, that, or that claim they don't believe in evolution. And my response generally is, oh, why not? Really, why not? There are discussions going on behind the scenes. Uh, a lot of people involved. It's all a bit... Uh, hush, 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 hush. I'm not sure I ought to say too much about it. Uh, let's see, uh, how can I put this? No. just becomes fantastically complicated when you don't believe in evolution. Here are these ancient dinosaur bones or fossils. Here is um, radioactivity. Here are distant stars that are just like the our star, but that are a different point in their life cycle. The idea of deep time, of this billions of years, uh, explains so much of the world around us. I'm not sure I understood the answer. Oh, look at that. You cannot beat that. If you try to ignore that, your, your worldview just becomes crazy it's just uh, untenable it's self inconsistent ha, ha, I won't take that as the personal dig I'm sure it was meant to be <laughs> that's what it's all about and I say to the grown-ups if you want to deny evolution and live in your in your uh, world that's completely inconsistent with everything we observe in the universe that's fine oh thanks but don't make your kids do it because we need them We need scientifically literate voters and taxpayers. For the future, we need people that can, uh, we need engineers that can build stuff, solve problems. It's just a really hard thing. It's, it's really a hard thing. You know, in another couple centuries, that, that worldview, I'm sure, will be, it just won't exist. I mean, it's, it's, there's no evidence for it. So. But the critical fact remains that all we have still is just anecdote. There are no close-up photographs, no artifacts, nothing that would convince a skeptic. 
all there are is stories and stories just aren't good enough on a matter of this importance